Coronation Street's Gary Windus, Mikey North, is set to panic when Brian Packham, Peter Gunn, tells him that he plans to take his metal detector into the woods. Fans know that Gary killed Lone Shark Rick Nalan after a brutal showdown in the woods, which ended with him burying him in the middle of nowhere. Adam Bolo, Sam Robertson, knows that Gary is hiding something, after Rick's ex Laura has pointed out Gary's strange behavior towards her, as he is pretending Rick is still alive. He and Imran begin to wonder whether Rick might be dead, and whether Gary has secretly killed him. Adam later approaches Gary and accuses him of killing Rick to get his hands on his business. Read more related articles Read more related articles Gary begins to worry about Brian and tries to convince him to not take his metal detector to the woods, despite Brian's insistence that he will find Roman coins. He soon realizes he can't change Brian's mind, so puts a shovel in his boot and drives to the woods to get rid of Rick's body. Little does he know, Brian and Bernie are following him and watching his every move. Read more related articles Read more related articles Will Gary realize the pair have worked out his killer secret and plot to get rid of Brian once and for all to keep his secret hidden? According to Buzz Bingo Coronation Street is the soap with the highest number of people bleeding to death. Three people have lost their lives in the grisly way, including Kylie Platt when she was stabbed in the heart and Pat Phelan when he took the knife out his body after being stabbed. Read more related articles Sharon Unwin also died in 2003 from internal bleeding after suffering from a perforated stomach ulcer. In comparison, EastEnders has had only had one, Stephen Beale, who died from a bleed on the liver after being pushed into a table by Max Branning. Meanwhile, Emmerdale has had deaths by people who have bled to death. Could Gary attack Brian and leave him to die to make sure his killer secret is never exposed? It certainly doesn't look good. Cory continues on Monday at 7. p.m. on ITV.